on top. Clean the back of your phone. Peel off the 3M back film. Stick on the center of your phone case. Press down firmly on the adapter. Try tearing the base off after 24 hours. Make sure they are securely held together. Attach the phone on the stem. Twist for 90 degree clockwise to secure it. Download and open the app. Create an account with your email. Repair my e-bike. Open the cover to expose the charging port on the e-bike. Plug in the charger. The light on the charging adapter should flash red in a few seconds. The fingerprint sensor flashes when the e-bike is activated. The app will search for e-bike with Bluetooth. When e-bike is found, tap to pair. Enter the pin shown on the right-hand side label. Or you can find the pin label under the frame. Place a finger on the sensor to add a fingerprint. Name your fingerprint before it is stored. Set your e-bike feature preferences. Name your e-bike to finish activation. Seat it or pinch the tires to check whether the tires are spongy. Pump up the tires to the pressure as indicated. Make sure the handlebar is perpendicular to the frame and front wheel. The wheels should move along when you turn. The handlebar and front fork should be firmly attached without looseness. Lift the front wheel up and down. Hold onto the handlebar and rock. Make sure the front fork is not loose. Squeeze the brake lever and release. The lever should return back in place. Lift and spin the rear wheel. Squeeze the brake lever tight and the spin should stop. Lift the e-bike and spin the front wheel. If there is noise at the brake, loosen the bolt on the caliber. Adjust the space between the disc and brake pads. Tighten bolts and spin the wheel again to check for any noise. Use the plus and minus buttons to choose the pedal assist power level. To turn on or off the front light, press the light button. You can also press and hold the light button for 3 seconds before releasing to power off your e-bike. To activate walk mode, press and hold minus button. Walk mode will stay on while the minus button is being held. Plug in the charger on the e-bike battery first, then into the wall outlets. The control panel light will turn on and turn off when the battery is completely charged. Here is the battery indicator when in normal state. Here is the battery indicator when charging. Open the app and tap the lock button to power on. The writing monitor at the control panel will turn on. You can tap the pause button to pause or resume your exercise recording. To power off, tap and hold the lock button.